day 27 of the carnivore diet and I have an incredible amount of energy. <laughs> I'm like a Duracell bunny at the moment and I'm really feeling it because I'm sleeping better. I'm not as weighed down. I don't have as much pain in my lower back. I've reduced my water retention and I feel like I look better and I look kind of more alive and I've got way more energy and with that more energy and that kind of creative flow I have to put that energy somewhere and I can feel that there's this thing coming through me of wanting to expand and wanting to go bigger and to, to grow and I can so see where I've been holding myself back due to my health and fitness. It is so clear to me what I've been doing and I've been staying small because small is comfortable, small is not out there, small can't be attacked, it can't be, you know, can't put myself out there too much and then get too much criticism. If, criticism. if I'm just over here playing small, which is good for no one, by the way. Um, it's, you know, it's safe. And actually, I used to think safety was around money and having money would make, you know, create safety. But the awareness that's come from this diet, this protocol, is that safety is more than money. Safety is totally about how I feel the strength within myself. And if I don't allow myself to feel the strength because I'm putting crap in my body and I feel weak, then I'm not going to feel secure. I'm not going to feel strong. And that is a massive part of that safety aspect. And then you can add money to it. And yes, the more money you have, the more you feel safe because you feel like you can do more things. But if the shops were shut, your money's good for no one. So it isn't really about money and finance. It's about safety. And that safety is the strength and the trust and the faith in myself that I can handle the new energy that's coming and it's coming. <laughs> this diet is bringing me so much awareness around what I'm, what I'm able to achieve, how I feel when I wake up, how I sleep, what I want to do, whether I've got discipline, you know, my mood, I've got headaches, am I feeling tired? Can I get up without my back hurting? It's like if I had no backache, no headaches, didn't have any, you know, problems in going to sleep didn't have any problems in waking up that would be a huge space and a huge thing that's now out of my life that's not holding me back anymore so who am I with all those ailments you know with all those problems who am I without them sorry and I'm so much more I'm so much bigger and stronger than I've been playing and I'm not saying I'm here to change the world I'm here to change myself but I'm really enjoying seeing this stronger version of me and I feel, so I always have a cat when I'm on this video, <laughs> a cat always comes and wanders around, but I feel like it's not even a new year, new me, it's like just me, you know, it's got nothing to do with the fact that we're going into 2023, yeah we can hype up and say hey new year January I'm going to do the best I can, great if that's what incentivizes you, but I don't need the new year to be a better version of me and the illusion of needing to wait until a specific time is just more excuses for not eating in the right way so I have decided that as, as I go for the continuation of this animal based diet carnivore diet I was going to do 30 days which would end on the first but no way with all these benefits and the way that I feel there is no way I am just going to stop on the first and say right job done this is a lifestyle this kind of eating and this kind of new energy that I've got and the way that I feel is a lifestyle why would I not want to live like this you know no one is paying me to say this at all this is total you know honest response from how I feel to what it's done it shows me my discipline it showed me my my you know my fear it showed me where I, I give up it shows me my emotions and all just because of a few changes in my diet I'm also saving a considerable amount of money because I'm not eating out in the same way as someone trimming hedges by the way in the background if you can hear I'm so sorry about that but I'm saving money because I'm not eating out in the same way and I'm enjoying my food more but I'm not buying anything from the supermarket in packaging nothing so I mean the most I've had in packaging is honey my honey pot and that's gonna last me for a good two months probably but the fact that I'm not buying anything with ingredients and packaging on is great so I feel like this is a whole new place for me to step into and more energy more time more focus is only going to bring a better version of me so if you haven't been doing this diet for very long and you're only just onto it please commit and see if you've never tried it and you want to find out more go to Paul Saladino on YouTube have a look at his stuff have a look if you want to go all meats have a look at Jordan Peterson and his daughter Michaela and see how you feel 
on the diet, see how it works for you and see if this is something that you know could help you feel as strong and as energetic as it does for me because I feel great and this is not me showing off this is just me really excited with more energy going oh I need to do another video so much more energy feeling much calmer and much more grounded in myself and feeling very very grateful that I have found this so Nico the guy that put this on for me I thank you very much <laughs> there's going to be more videos of me and Nico but for now this is just a behind the scenes with the head trimmer in the background and me sharing how much I'm enjoying my process and my journey so if you haven't liked already please do if you can subscribe that would make me very happy I've gone up 71 subscribers in the last 28 days so I'm very happy back on YouTube doing more and feeling more grounded and very excited to continue this and yeah to see where it goes so love to you all have an amazing day and I will see you on the next video